Using Optifine, you can install beautiful shaders that will make your game look a hundred times better. Using Optifine, you can also zoom on small objects instead of having to go all the way to options and go FOV 30. And the zoom even goes past FOV 30. You can even go a lot farther. I know what you're saying, Optifine is great, how do I get it for 1.16? The 1.16 was just released maybe 10 days ago. Is it possible to get it now? And to that, I say yes. And in this tutorial, I'll show you how to. The first thing you're going to want to do is open up Google Chrome or whatever internet browsing software you have. And now what you're going to want to do is go up to the top of your Chrome where you can enter in a URL and type in Optifine, and that's it. But you might want to actually type in Optifine.net because there are websites that claim to be Optifine, which aren't really Optifine. Once you've typed that, you may go ahead and click Enter. Then you will be taken to the main page of Optifine. Then you're going to want to go to Downloads, and then click Preview Versions. What you're going to want to do now is click download now i've had times where the download doesn't work will take you to an ad that will take you somewhere else and if that happens to you too what you're going to want to do is click mirror but in order to make sure you know that the optify knows that you like optifine you might want to click the download button then what you want to do is click the download preview optifine 1.16.1 or whatever it might say that this is going to harm your computer, and then you're going to want to say keep. Then, before you click that, you're going to want to X out. Uh, but, uh, I thought it was finished downloading. All right, there you go. Then you want to X out a Google Chrome, and then open up your Minecraft. Now, it should take you here. You're going to want to click play on latest release. Because in order for Optifine to install, you need to play on the latest release before Optifine can install. There we go, now it is starting. And there you go, Minecraft Java Edition, made by Jeb. Okay, now that you're here, you're going to go ahead and click Quit Game. Locate your preview Optifine 1.16 Pre 2 or whatever pre-release it is, and then you're going to want to double-click it. It should bring up the Optifine installer. For Optifine HD Ultra G2 Pre 2 for Minecraft 1.16.1. Then, it will give you this, your folder. Then you're going to want to click install. Then it'll take some time, and then it'll say Optifine is successfully installed. Now when you go play Minecraft again, you will have Optifine 1.16.1. And you can go ahead and click play. And there you go! We are now playing with Optifine. Things I like about Optifine is that you can zoom. It looks, uh, oh. Don't, don't question it. If you don't know where we are, we're on the Survival Series server. You can check out those videos by going to the playlist and then click on Survival Series Season 3. That's where we are in Overlords' is base. But that is how you can get Optifine for 1.16 and future. You can always just click on Preview Optifines. And there's a version that isn't there on Preview the Optifines. Then you can go ahead and see how far it is from, from being complete. What you want to do is then search Optifine 1.16 Progress. And then it'll take you to the Reddit page, if you click that, load, and then it will say Optifine is dash done. And I saw the unstable preview releases are here, and they will work. Now, in the Pre-2 release, you can have shader support. If you don't know how to install shaders, there'll be a video link in the description below. And yeah, this is how you can download Optifine for 1.16. Anyways, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a big fat thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. And also, please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already pressed that post notification button. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Also, in the end screen that you're about to see, you will see a video on how to download shaders. If you don't know how to do it, then click that video to be taken to how to download shaders. And that's about it from me. I'll see you guys in a future episode. Goodbye, everybody!